winning. Have letter number 5838. November 18, 2016. Perhaps one day you just walk into a department store, and you are handed a piece of paper with a number on it. It is possible you are holding a winning ticket. How easy it is to win something just like that, without effort. You were innocent. You walked into a store. You have a chance to win something, and so nice when you do actually win it. It is a blessing to feel lucky. Just that, lucky. You wear a big smile. The universe has just blessed you. It blessed you from out of the blue. You are pleased. This is how I desire you to feel at every turn in the world, favored by the universe. The universe looks forward to blessing you. The universe is all for you. No need and no way to verify a winning lottery ticket ahead of time. You can't. Who said you have to know ahead of time? No one except you perhaps. Dear one, you don't even have to have a long list of reasons why you should win, deserve to win, or must win. When you win, you win. You got tapped on your shoulder. You just had to be there within reach. When it comes to happiness in life, I most assuredly request that you enter into life fully with your heart secure. Without discussion, open up that heart of yours. I never advise that you urge your heart to sulk. There is no way I suggest you discourage yourself from coming out ahead. Never do I want to hear you say or intimate, nah, I'll never win. Be your own booster. There may be a job you want. Why on earth would you point out the reasons why you might not be hired? Is this what friends do? Are you your own friend or not? Come on, is it more beneficial for you to talk yourself out of doing something or is it better to say yes? The question isn't about winning. The question is about entering. Do you choose door one or door two? One, I'll never get that job. I don't stand a chance. Two, I'd love that job. I'm going to go for it. For instance, who said you mustn't apply for a job unless you're quite sure you will get it? Possibilities are opportunities. Even impossibilities are opportunities. Don't walk away. Treasures exist. You do not know with absolute certainty behind which door your treasure lies. The only way to find out is to knock. There is that process called winning. It happens. And when you actually win, you see there was nothing to it. Beloveds, winning is easy. Have you been thinking otherwise? There is nothing that cannot happen in anyone's life, and that means your life too. You have said that something or another never worked before. Now you conclude that it won't work this time either. And this is how you eliminate yourself. You don't even give it a try. You stop in your tracks as soon as you automatically ruled something out. Even if the odds are 100 to 1, or 10 trillion to 1, what do you care? Never say, that can never happen. You don't know what can happen. It is for you to enter life. So enter it. Don't be what the world calls irrealistic. Realistic is another way of saying, who do I think I am? Good fortune isn't for me. I might as well cross myself off. This will never work for me. And so you take yourself out of the race, sure in the knowledge that you are right, that you can't win, as if not entering makes you virtuous. Hey, be wrong for once. Who knows what lies behind closed doors? Be open. Knock. Or, if you need a key, the key is to go forward. What do you think it means when I tell you to let go of the past? Certainly, it doesn't mean to stay just as you are. Unless you are open, you are closed. Channeled by Gloria Wendroff. HeavenLetters.org